We can go this way to start. I'm Dr. Todd Pearson from the Department of Ecology, Evolution, and Organismal Biology. And we're out here today catching salamanders in this creek in Atlanta for our research on reproductive behavior. In the broadest sense, we're trying to answer one of the, the biggest questions in biology, which is how is variation maintained in populations? And we're doing that by studying this really common salamander, which has two different types of males that coexist. These are called two-lined salamanders. One male goes and looks for mates in the uplands in the forest, and the other male waits in the stream and finds its mates there. By surveying many different streams, we're seeing which of those males is more common and which kinds of streams, and if that can help us understand how they coexist through time. There's one. These are some of the most abundant vertebrates in any ecosystem in the Eastern US. And Georgia has about the most diversity of salamanders of anywhere in the world. Because they're so abundant, because they're so common, we can catch them in streams even right here close to campus. Some of the research we do, we collect data in the field. We're done by the end of that. A lot of what we do though is we collect DNA samples from the salamanders. We can learn so much more by studying their DNA than just the salamanders themselves. In each of the next three fall semesters, we'll have about 15 students enrolled in a class where the whole function of the class is to give really authentic, deep research experience. Since I was a kid, I was very interested in amphibians and reptiles and other organisms that get little attention. And so I started working as an undergraduate myself in a research lab studying these salamanders. I mean, I, I love being a professor. I like to teach, I like to do research, and I just like having the autonomy to pursue what makes you excited. I think that's when uh, academia is at its best. 